anyway, the information, everything, um, like I said, we're generally okay with people can talk, but I end up talking too much, I'm talking too much to cover, to, to cover truth, to try and unlock it, to then transfer it and say it in a way where it gets through, and that's the battle with schizophrenia, because you have to be right, you, you know, being brought up the way you have to be right about it. Everything you're doing, can it be justified? Yes, so it's okay to do, and then it goes as far as the next. Can that be justified? Yeah, well, yeah, it can. So, because you convince yourself of it, because you're that sure you're space trained, you're just that sure of it, and that's the battle with it. You know, mine, mine is the worst because I've I've included so many of them there. And um, I never needed to, but then I did, because we're at a crossroads with schizophrenia and with thought disorder. Um, and it goes as far as that. It goes, well, Jehovah's a killer. Jesus is a killer, because he's going to kill someone. Moses, Exodus, everyone in heaven were killers. So... What was the justification that had I eaten someone that I'm not allowed to be a killer when they were a bad person? Because I'm always covering my tracks about how good I was. Do you see how it, it does justify and, and rolls out? It's not a threat. You know, this is a weight gain. This is the strength I have. The power over. And I want you to heal. I want you to heal. You know, if you've come on this ride with me, it's been a big one, and it's okay. You need to heal and let me go. This is not a suicide. I'm asking you to heal yourself from what you've heard, what you've seen, what's you've written, and heal yourself, because I don't want to be responsible for anyone losing their nut. See what I mean? I bring that out to justify myself for power. It's a subconscious of that. And that lives in all man. Not just me. We, we subsequent, subconsequently using this in a way that's not healthy. It's not healthy. But we can't change because we're immovable. I'm a schizophrenic. What more can you tell me that I already don't know? And what more can I give that you may or may never know? It's an impossibility. It stops deep connections. It stops real life. Living. Heal yourself. Heal yourself. This is fucking hell. Oh, was it the saddest song? It's 10 billion songs. Sometimes about a Casio. Just, there's a Casio here and fuck it. Just write about that. Take it personally as yourself. You know, what I have in space is merely just something on YouTube that I can look at in a minute. It's not physically here. I'm not going to physically kill you. It's only something I can look at and think, wow, we designed that. But, you know, deep breaths, deep breaths. Coming off Earth is hard. It was hell. It was a living hell. It did not stop. I've forgotten that life. And stop. I wanted to win somewhere I could never. The sun in the sky. <laughs> Come on. Then they see me funny and take some jokes from it. And you gotta heal yourselves. There is an afterlife. Half of us have been there. You know, coming back. Oh, what's death gonna be like? I tried to explain it. It was something in your mind. 
you know, you think we're constantly hearing voices or things. I get faces. They dare speak to me now. But you heal. You know, this is part of me putting it up to heal myself as well. To make records of how I am and to listen back and think, come on. Lost my willpower. It's been much stronger than this. I used to work shifts, no breaks. It's the hardest worker. I'm not trying to be off on the doll. I'm not trying to be off on the doll. I'm not work for you. We will work for you. Subconsciously, in spirit, or however, we will do the job and we will get it done. We're not useless. You have to trust us. In a war, we'd be able to spot the one that you needed because we would have heard where it was coming from. That's just another insight. You know, don't just knock us all off, but don't fall in love with us. I had a man. I've had three. Three marriages, all of them are dead. I had a marriage just sitting on the street with someone. Did magic, she had her own place and she lived, but by the time I got there it was too late, she's dead. It was a 20 minute walk for me, but it was 5,000 years for her. She had enough. I put it to rest. <laughs> That's what it's like. <laughs> put it to rest. And you need to put your ghost to rest. And heal yourself. 